Okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to Soul Calibur 6. Uh, we are returning to this game because... Well, not returning. I have been playing this game in my free time. Just haven't been uploading much of it to YouTube. Uh, however, it's time to return because 2B is out. 2B from Near Automata, which is actually one of my favorite games of 2017. It only came in second behind Cuphead last year, so yeah. When I heard that she was going to be in Soul Calibur, I was like, damn, really? She's kind of a weird DLC choice when you think about it. But, you know, I think I'm okay with it. I mean, she doesn't fit any more or less than fucking uh, Noctis does in Tekken 7. So, who are we to complain about anything? Hold up. Oh, there it is. Okay. I knew she had a stage. I was just like, I need to find it as well. So yeah, uh, I've seen some gameplay of her. I'm not going into this completely blind. And, you know, this is not going to be like an two-hour in-depth anal analysis of the character. Analysis? Fuck, I can't even speak. Uh, we're just going to look at her key moves. We're going to try her out, how she feels. Honestly, I'm going to say it right now. She's probably not going to be a character that I'll play. She doesn't seem like uh, the type that I would play. Even though she is super hoey. Uh... I think maybe, oh shit, what the hell is going on here? She is, yeah, probably one of the top 10 biggest hoes in the game. I mean, look at look at it. Just look. Is there anything else I need to say? I mean, she jiggles like a motherfucker, first of all. Uh, apparently I've forgotten how to control this game too. There we go. So yeah, she jiggles like hell. Uh, no matter what you do. Yeah, I mean, but that's every character in Soul Calibur, but I mean, this, yeah. Does this need any explanation? I can't even imagine what her lethal hits feel like. Uh, feel like? Why did I say feel like? See, this is, this is, this is what these characters do to you. Um, but they feel great. So anyways, uh, from what I've seen, even gameplay-wise, she really reminds me of Noctis. Uh, this must be... Oh, this is a stance. She just chills. She looks like a trolley character, I'm gonna be honest with you. Uh, holy shit. So yeah, something like Ivy, a combination of Ivy, and again, like, really knock this ish because I do know that she has a bunch of, like, uh, air moves, which we'll look into, and apparently everything she, she does is swag. Uh, you don't need to, like do much with her for it not to be flashy we're just gonna uh set our dummy up i yeah uh, yeah i thought so most of what she does is probably not even real combos holy okay i don't even know how i did that yeah the first two links oh shit so she has this dash. Okay, that's her launcher. But yeah, as you can see, she has like, holy shit. I don't even know what I'm doing. Like, I legit... Yeah. She has a kick as well. Yeah, again. Really flashy. Speaking... Oh, that's how you activate it. Yeah, I mean... She is gonna be an absolute noob killer online. Like, this is gonna be the type of character, if you don't know what to do against her, she is gonna fuck you up. I mean, even this is very Noctis-ish. <laughs> don't... That is actually a legit real combo. It seems to do so much damage. This is just bag BB. Yeah, they actually just put tits on Noctis and put her into Soul Calibur and named her 2B. Anyways... Let's go ahead and look at them moves. Our slash sequence, we looked at that. Alright, slash support for the AA. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh wait, no. Okay, that was a okay, never mind. So yeah, not a not a real combo. Why why did they put this in the key moves though? Projectile slash sequence. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've, we've done that. Alright, we've done that. I almost want to turn off 
and they guard all just to see it. First strike into aerial leap. We've done that. We've explored, well, kind of what you could do. So yeah, she has like a bunch of follow-ups. And all of them combo. But this one... That one seems to be one of the better ones. I wonder if you can follow it up with something. If she has like some really... <coughs> excuse me. Like really long range. That's gonna sound lovely. We'll see. We'll see. Next up is Pod Program R05 Spear. Yeah, these are all... Uh, Holy shit. Oh, that's the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is kind of a zoning move. Th again, this is straight up IV inspired. Hold on. So yeah, you can make this into a... Not a lethal hit, but... What do you call this? Guard impact? No, I don't know. I forgot my Soul Calibur terminology. I wonder if you can... Yeah, kind of. You can block out of it. Mobilize slash pattern. Oh, that that is good. That is really good. Kind of a low. It stuns as well. Put you into a spin state. Oh yeah, let's check out her throws. This is the back one. Oh, that's the baseball. Yeah, I. You know, I'm looking at these. I do remember most. Holy shit, she's she is really cool. I am liking her. This back throw is sick. Yeah, I do remember most of these moves from Nier Automata. I, I mean, I played that game extensively. It's I really love that game. So, I'm happy that she's in. Again, she just gameplay-wise, this is not the type of character that I play. I'm pretty happy with Voldo. What the hell? Hold on, how did I do that? So, you can go into this. You can go into that by holding it down. Yes. Holy sh All right, hold on. We got to check this out. All right, just for just for a tiny bit, just continue action. All right, hold it down. That was a different one, but still I don't even remember <coughs> I don't even remember what I did. That's the one. That is so cool. Very low damage though, got to admit. I mean, with all this flashy stuff, it generally tends to be on the lower damage side. Okay, that, now that is a good move. Super long range. Fucking knock this. See, this is the thing, people constantly... What the... Oh, that's her taunt. I accidentally did that. That's really cool. But this is some like, weird back. Oh, that's... That's gonna be good. She is for sure g gonna be an absolute noob killer. That's really cool as well. I don't know how I did that. That's it. All highs. Yeah, she just seems to be... You can do anything and it's gonna... That lethal hit? What's the requirement? Don't tell me just hit them. Okay, we've checked that out. Who's gonna look at her normals. Are you fucking serious? That's her back. That is insane because if you don't know, uh, good jump moves are pretty much a requirement for a good character in Soul Calibur. And what was that other shit I did? That's the one. I really wonder if you can. You can kind of. You can follow up though. There might be something better than this. Um, yeah, again, I can only say what I've been saying. She's straight up knocked. Oh, what the? God damn it. Pussy in the face. Eat this bitch. <laughs> Look at Okay, that's good. She just like... She... Oh, that's a different one. I was gonna say... She really like... Gets in there with that. I mean, seriously. During aggression shift. Aggression shift is gotta be the... This one. Because it goes into the aerial leap. I'm for sure it is. I'm for sure. 
yeah. Alright, let's check out her sample combos. So that's B and A, 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 B. Yeah, I think I figured this one out myself. Um, hold B. B and kick. What the hell? Oh, yeah. Let's just look at that. Maybe it does something. Oh, what? Oh my god, her super looks really cool. Yeah, there's a... Hold on. I'm about to... Just look at this super. Which I straight up missed with. Cool, get the sword. Initiating attack problem. The pod, I always loved the pod from Nier, honestly. Better character than most games have main character, you know. I had really good personality, the pods. Oh, this is a super good super. Ha. No pun intended. Man, this is sick. This super is... I wish she did the laser instead of the whatever. I wonder about her soul charge. She must be able to do some crazy shit with that, yeah. Yeah, I can already tell. Just mashing B that did some crazy shit. Uh, she has the laser. Holy... Okay, it's a high. But, you know, fucking uh, Cervantes is shot. And it stuns as well. So if you, like, hit from here, you, yeah, you can combo. I mean, you're not gonna, but... Still... I mean, the very fact that that's a thing. That that looks really good. I don't know. Hold on. Did I just do that? Because I think I turned guard back on, didn't I? That combos... Whoa. She is insane. Like, this character online is going to give so many people a bad time. Like, people are, I can already tell, people are gonna be crying on Reddit, complaining that this character is cheap. Yeah, okay, that's the one I did. Because I think she's gonna be an absolute noob killer. <clears throat> Let's check out her lethal hits. Assault Helix. Yeah, this one seems like you just gotta hit with it. I've done this one. Uh, projectile Slash Sequence. These are probably the ones that have... Triggers upon hitting an opponent when your soul... G oh, okay, that's why. Triggers upon hitting opponent from back. Uh, could happen. Triggers upon... Yeah, 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 yeah. Plus two analysis points upon hit. She has a mechanic. Alright, let's check this out. That's not the one. Wait, hold on. Ford B and K. But that's not the one, right? Unless I like really. That's crazy. She must have like some other moves at core disruption back K. Yeah, I know that one. So for sure she has some weird mechanic. Let's look at her uh, special moves. Again, I'm not gonna go too deep into her. Ha. Well, I know some people would like to. I prefer A2. She was the real, the real waifu of Nier Automata. Yeah, we know the aggression shifts. She has so much. What? <laughs> that just... That is crazy. Look at how... Look at how much range that has. Special mid. This character. Wait. She has... Don't tell me she has a grab out of it. She has a grab out of it. With like a special crazy ass grab animation. Oh man. This is... This is gonna be fun. To watch people get salty about I'm probably gonna get salty about her. I can already... Th this is... Yeah. She's drags. <laughs> She's cool. I am honestly... Again. 
Still wouldn't put her in the category of I'd play. But goddamn if she isn't well designed. I mean like really seriously. Extremely well designed. Half of this shit I don't even know how I'm doing, but that that's really good. So can she like Oh man. Like it's weird because there are so many boring characters in this game, kind of. Well, not so many, but there's a few boring characters in this game. Uh, my main, Safitia, honestly is unfortunately among them in that her core moveset... Okay, you can transition into this. Her core, core moveset is pretty basic, you know. She does her sword stuff, she does her, you know, whatever. Uh, you can make her naked by lethal hitting her, all that, but... This is like, she's like really crazy. They got super creative. Which is kind of how it was with the Tekken DLC characters as well. I mean like Geese, Howard and Noctis and all that. You know. They got like really, again, like super creative. That looks like a good move as well. Oh shit. Now that looks... That has more range than I thought. And you can... I wonder if you can combo. Probably if you hold it down, right? That's gonna be a nightmare to deal with. Man, I am making so many accidental puns. Yeah, I think going into the run you're definitely gonna be able to transition or combo something. Initiating attack program. Really cool. Wish the last hit was the laser still. Oh, and she has the fucking self-destruct, doesn't she as well? Wait, what does it say? Enemy remains active. Is that... I forgot his name. 9S, right? That's 9S. I think that it was... 9S, right? I, I, I... It's been a while. It been, it been... All right, we are. Oh, she has a self-destruct. Limiter release, self-destruct. Training mode only. Why would you have something training mode only? Whatever. Let's check it out. No. Wait, wasn't it forward? The boy gotta look at it again. Yeah. Oh, and at low health. All right. Whatever. So it's like. A and K, oh. Oh, so that you can see it. She even does like, oh, she, she does the predator. That takes a chunk. Not as much as I thought, like, if you hit your opponent with that, this doesn't look easy to hit with. Do you see how long of a, it's only a mid and it has a crazy long startup. Yeah, I think that should like straight up kill. No, I'm only kidding, of course. This character already looks good. Um, I don't know what though. I don't know. I'm not a pro, but... Will she be able to compete against the likes of Ivy and all that? I think she has a chance. Like, she seems crazy enough. If nothing else, she's gonna be a nightmare to deal with online, as stated. Again, really well designed. Maybe one thing I kind of don't like is her default pose. Her, like, she holds her arms in a weird way, but, you know, who the fuck is paying attention to her arms, really, when you think about it? Uh, yeah. Well done. First DLC character. Well, do you count Tira? I don't know if you should... I don't think we should count Tira. She should have been in the game to start with, but, you know... Triple-A games, oh, is it, this is not even a triple-A game, but modern gaming, gotta have the pre-order DLC. Uh, but overall, as a first DLC character, uh, she seems impressive, so... Whoever is coming out next, which we don't have any information on, is probably gonna be good. Hopefully it's gonna be a Soul Calibur character. We'll find out when we find out. Hope you enjoyed this little look at 2B. Um, yeah, I don't know. We'll see her online, I guess. Maybe I'll play her. I don't know. I haven't decided. 
I haven't decided because honestly I didn't expect to like her at all before coming into this first look but now now my mind is kind of changed so yeah thanks for watching guys make sure to like this video subscribe do all that if you haven't yet I'm really trying to hit 10k before the end of the year not sure if that's gonna happen I need like a hundred and something subs which is unlikely but still thanks for watching and see you guys goodbye